Good morning, I am Mrs. Harris, the Career Specialist. Today I'm going to tell you about being an interpreter or a translator. Have you ever met someone who speaks another language? Maybe you have a classmate who speaks Spanish and is learning to speak English. A translator is someone who converts the written word from one language to another. An interpreter, on the other hand, is someone who translates orally or through sign language interpretation. Although translators typically need a bachelor's degree, the most important requirement is that they be fluent in English and at least one other language. Many complete job-specific training programs. The goal of a translator is to have people read the translation as if it were the original. To do that, the translator must be able to write sentences that flow as well as the original, while keeping ideas and facts from the original source accurate, which means right. They must consider any cultural references, including slang and other expressions that do not translate literally. Many translators are self-employed. Their schedules often vary with alternating periods of maybe they work a little bit or maybe they work a lot. Still, most work full-time with regular business hours. Did you know that one out of every five Americans speaks a language other than English at home? That's more than 50 million people who speak Spanish, Chinese, French, German, Russian, or some other language. So imagine the growing need for people who can translate and interpret between English and these languages. Many businesses and government agencies have an urgent need for translators to help them communicate with their customers. Wow, that's a pretty exciting career. I hope you enjoyed this week's report, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Now back to your anchors.